Okay, so what we're going to see here is validation rules. So when I change the status to acquired and click save, we see that we did not put in an acquired date. And if I pick an acquired date from a previous month and click save, again, we're going to get another error because I am not allowed to report in a previous month. That means that we have some reports that are dependent on this field, and they are going to be running automatically each month to get the data from last month. Because if I run on the first of the month, then I don't have any data for the current month, so they can only get data from the last month, which means data that is going to be run next month on next month's report on, again, the first of the month needs to be properly dated for that month. So if I pick today's date and click save, it will now let me save it. And this is how validation rules can be used to better control your data.